snake spirits where we are going to talk about the full moon in capricorn energy so if anyone is feeling extremely emotional and in their feelings and trying to really contemplate where their heart sits and what they want it is normal that's the energy right now. Now, as of today and yesterday, I think, or tomorrow, I think it's today and tomorrow, we're in the full moon in Capricorn energy, and that stables us out. It is a very um, stabilizing energy. It will help you, like this is a time where you need to think about what makes you feel stable. Why isn't that more in your life? Um, what elements in your life make you feel unstable and why are they not removed from your life? What makes you feel like home? That's the energies that you're really kind of, that's what will make you feel so much more grounded in this full moon energy is to really understand where is my stability, where does it come from? And you you always have control of it, but where are you outsourcing where you shouldn't be outsourcing? That's what you've got to ask yourself. Using your intuition. Could be when it comes to your finances. You might be feeling like you're constantly like living paycheck to paycheck or doing <clears throat> like paying one bill at a time and then hoping that you have enough like you rob Bob to pay bill or whatever that you know you know what I mean but like to never have enough to live paycheck to paycheck and then being stuck there and feeling like you're constantly in this cycle of like, I think I get out, I get just a little bit of savings, I get just, 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 like I just, I just come out of it. And then the car breaks down or the, the house floods or something gets set on fire or an alarm gets set off. Like there's a million things that could go on, but it's that that you just get out and then something comes in and grabs your money. Two of Pentacles. That's about juggling. But knowing what, what you need to drop in order for success when it comes to your money. Now stability is usually money, but it can be like some people find love is stability. Some people find, you know, their their kids is stability or their household is stability. Like stability comes in many forms. So the five of pentacles could be wherever you're feeling out in the cold, where you feel like no one cares and you're all by yourself. All by myself. You know, that feeling. Again. Except this we got the two of swords. Like, knowing where the bullseye is. But yet you're blinding yourself. Like, you don't know? Or maybe you're so confident that you do know. But you just haven't taken that step. Maybe because you feel like you can't. You feel tied to something. But it's at a point where it's seeping through the ground. Like, you smell the raunch. You're like, I can't do this anymore. I'm going to have to go out of and find a new, brand new, passionate opportunity. And heal. Sometimes that is the passionate opportunity, is to take time by yourself. Aces are about self. Finding what's your passion. What is your passion? 
you know? I mean, it's finding what makes you tick. What needs to be in your life in order for you to want and to enjoy to live day by day? Standing in your value, knowing your worth, being stable in yourself. Enough to drop your burdens and go where you need to go and do what you need to do. And that's what I have for you. So I hope you are very stable during this time and you enjoy and really think about what it is that is needed in your life to make you feel grounded, stable, happy, and ready to enjoy this crazy thing we call life. That's what I have for you. Peace, love, and light.